On this edition of Check 6 the Aviation, we're unboxing this monster. Welcome back, my friend, to another edition of Check 6 the Aviation. As I said in the opening, we are opening up this box right here. <sighs> Very exciting time. And I've got my my beautiful young, my beautiful eldest daughter, Serena, here. I say this now. <laughs> Girl. Now. She's a ham. What can I say? She's part of me. And I'm a cow. She, you are not a cow. Mal. Mal, Mal, I'm a cow. Okay, yeah. That seems to be their theme song. So we are going to open this. This is the Behringer system. Behringer setup. Now I'd already received the, the tires uh, that were drop shipped to me from Aircraft Spruce. Those are out in the workshop. I'll get to the workshop here in a moment you know, as far as where we're at on the, on the workshop build. Um, but where we are is we're gonna try, we're gonna get this open right now because it does say inspect before accepting. Inspect upon receipt and I have 30 days to notify Behringer of any problems with this because these do come from France so let's go ahead and get into this now I did get the air sense system along with this and what is the air sense system is is think of the TPMS warning light that you sometimes see on your car the tire pressure monitoring system the air sense is exactly that. It monitors the tire pressure in your airplane's um, tires. But here's the thing to keep in mind. The batteries are good for a very long time if you do not install the air sense system into your tires and inflate them. Because once you do that, then the batteries only last for two years. So if you are in the process, uh, if you're not going to be using your system for a number of years like me, then you want to hold off on putting air in your tires. You can mount your tires on your rims, but do not inflate them because you'll be pre you'll be changing the batteries after a couple years. And once again, my good friend Steve at Aircraft, Sp Aircraft Specialties, otherwise known as AS Flight Lines, was great to work with. He helped me or get all of this order together. That's the AirSense system there. This is actually packed very well. And right there, that's it. That's it right there. Three, three packages for three tires, three wheels. The box itself weighs about 40 pounds here. So it's, it's quite, a, quite massive. See what we got in here. We got more packing. This. Okay, so also this entire box is not including my brake cylinders because those have been sent off to Paul at Control Approach to be mounted onto my rudder pedals. Let's see, where did this? Yeah, we'll just get the knife here. This will be good fun for the girls later. Let's see. Amy. 
This is what? Red Kalub. Hydraulic fluid. Ah, the brake fluid. Okay, here we go. Yes. So, nice to know that that comes with it. Won't be needing it for a while. We have. Uh, I'm not sure what all this is except for this. This is for the, the wheels, uh, you know, the spindle, the hub. All of this is very well packed, by the way. By the way. Ah, Behringer stickers, instruction maintenance manual. Very well packaged. Very well packaged. All right. As any guy would, we'll put that aside for later. We have, ooh. okay. It's in French though, or, okay. There we go, Behringer 10th anniversary. And these will be, This is brake cylinder. Okay. Okay, for bleeding the brakes, I would presume. That's the only thing I can think of. Of course, if Steve over at AS Flight Lines is watching this, then he can go ahead and kind of. direct my attention to what is really important. Nothing like quality workmanship. Everything looks really, really good. Red. Sealed bearings. Red anodizing for what will be a white face on an airplane. Very, very shiny. Yes. So that's one. Small box. Small box. Let's put, let's see what's in this small box. Small. So look at my journal. Okay. Aha! The nose wheel. I can tell this is the nose wheel because of the size. It is smaller than the other two. And the box is just smaller than the other two. Now, keep in mind, in here, there's going to be some seals. Yeah. I just noticed that. Right. Stuffed in here. rubber seals so it pays to keep to look inside the, the wheels here as a matter of fact let me look let me take another look in here okay so there's nothing else in there 
We're good there. And everything looks good you know, over here. So we are good to go. Get those two boxes. Now the other three. One, two, three. <coughs> this will be the other main wheel. Finally, you never read about that side. And once again, if you look down, look down in there, you see another rubber piece. More seals, more spare seals. So those need to be retrieved out of there. We'll put those down there. But again, no damage, everything came out okay. All the way from Viva La France. La France. All right, two more boxes. This is gonna be uh, some more of the brake. This will be the brakes, more than likely. Yep, brake discs and calipers. For one side and likely the other. Was there one more? Oh, right, right there. Okay. The last box. <coughs> I'm being a little bit more gentle with this one because you'll see why here in a second. I ended up on the last box cutting this lip off. Did not mean to. And once again, everything is looking good. We are good to go. Hi. And with that, let's go outside and get a quick update on where we are with the workshop. All right, we're back out here. Give you a quick update of what's going on. As you can see, I've got exterior insulation on most of the way around. I've got a good that taken care of up there. Uh, I have ex exterior paneling too that have already been primed. These were bare wood when I got them. And around here, most of the way done i'll have to trim this off but we have exterior paneling on this will be painted red and Grass we have dirt. we have channel a dirt we have dirt for the uh, yeah for the electrical to go all the way back there to the box so that is what we've got going on here. But unfortunately for me, time has expired this time around. That's why things are going a little slow because well, being an active participant in our nation's economy, I've got loads to haul, places to go and things to see, things to do. But with that, we're going to cut this video off here until next time remember this time and always if you are if you enjoy con aviation content especially getting prepared to build like we are now an airplane or even if you like aviation content like um like i've been trying to produce in the past 
and then by all means share this video with your friends and neighbors and uh, help them to find our other pages our, our other, other social feeds like Facebook uh, give us a like preferably a thumbs up if you especially if you want to see us finish this project here and start building an airplane and give us a comment down below comments likes they really do help the channel they tell the YouTube algorithm that this needs to be shared this needs to be uh, spread within the the YouTube ecosystem or if you know or uh, some of the other platforms that I'll be I'll be sharing this video on uh, like rumble yes and also subscribe about maybe 68 percent maybe a little bit more of the people that actually watch my content are not subscribed it's got me going why what am I what can I do better comment down below I know some of the music has been off uh, especially in the last video where I yeah took a tour of control approach and saw how they make the rudder pedals there um, that video was kind of rushed I didn't get the the levels quite right I was in a situation where I'm like I am now where I was on my way out the door to go haul loads I chased a cat away okay oh I don't care if it poops <sighs> Anyway, my girls, I love them. Anyway, thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below. What can we do better? Uh, visit our other social media feeds. YouTube uh, is, well, Rumble. We're start, we started a page on Rumble. Um, also, check out our Patreon page if you wanted to support the channel financially. You know, five, minimum of $5 a month. Uh, can will go a long way to finishing this project uh, and it would be greatly appreciated um, with that always check your sex peace